Hey guys, okay, so yesterday I found this species of caterpillar and uh, I didn't want to film it that day. I wanted to wait be, so they, they could settle on their plant because they're a little bit smaller ones. But this is the Colosamia agulifera. In other words, the uh, tulip silkworm. I mean, the tulip silk moth. The caterpillars are basically identical to the Promethea moth in every single way, except the Promethea moth, moth caterpillar, if that makes sense, if this makes sense, look more plastic. They look fake. They look like a toy. My friend pointed that out to me when I showed him a picture of it. But these look like a refined caterpillar. And the uh, males tend to have the uh, translucent patches on their skin, on, on their wings when they are in fact moths. As caterpillars, they feed in groups. When I found them, I found, I have 11 of them. I found two on this leaf here, and on this leaf I found the other nine. And they were like a few inches from their eggs. They're doing quite nicely in here. I, they, obviously they eat the tulip tree leaves. And, uh, I couldn't wait to, uh, show you guys that. During the winter, I'm going to go look for, on the update of the Promethea moth, it did cocoon and pupate. I'm going to show that now, actually. Let's cocoon here. Well, let me just get it let me just show you guys the pupa here the moth pupa and uh since i only have one and i speculate it to be a male i'm only going to uh I'm going to go out during winter time and look for more cocoons of it or look for more caterpillars of it because I really want to breed both of these species. But here I got 11 and I only found one of those. And actually since these are basically just the same species, I put this guy in here. Um, also I have a few updates. You guys need to see this. Okay, so the only other video of this particular moth that I could find on the internet was Bart Copens. And this particular moth that I have, and I'm about to show, uh, and like tomorrow, is going to be the Anterea Hogmoni. Hogmoni. I am going to be breeding that. I have eggs of it. I, I bought ten. And, uh, yeah, you guys have to see that. Um, I'm also going to be, uh, what am I trying to say here? I also bought a ton of cocoons. I got Saturnia Pavona, which have came in, and I will show you guys those when I get back, when I get to them. Um, camera's not focusing. Camera's not focusing on these guys. That's mean. Yeah, I'll focus on this guy. Um, some other species, which I'm actually proud that I got, um, they haven't come in yet, they're going to, is Rodinia fugax, Curricula trifinesta, trifinestra, Antarea jana, and I'm pretty sure there's one more that I'm forgetting about. Um, I don't think I am. No, but I'm getting all those guys, and I will be breeding them. So, look out for that. Alright guys, I guess this is goodbye until the next video. Peace.